Open Godot, head to Asset Library then search for VRM Importer and install it. After that go to Project under Plugins, make sure enable the two plugins Mtune Shader for the Vroid Shader and VRM for the Importer. Now, open Vroid Studio and create your model, for this tutorial we will just use a template from Vroid. You can use your own creation. After that, export it and save it within your chosen folder. In my case, I directly saved it inside my project folder. You can remove the based mesh if you're not going to use it for character customization since it's not always visible and covered by the character's hair. After your customization, make sure to enable edit hair cross-section and delete transparent meshes, which will help to reduce the number of polygons within your model. Now open Godot and open your VRM model. Now we need to create a new bone map by selecting the general skeleton. Under the retarget section, create a new bone map then click the created bone map and create a new skeleton profile humanoid. After that, Click Reimport. This is necessary for transferring animations from Mixamo to your model. Next, I'll just create a new scene for the model itself. You can directly put it inside your character scene or player scene. Instantiate the VRM directly to your chosen scene. Make sure to save it a SCN instead of TSCN.SCNS are binary scenes. They tend to be smaller and faster to load. If you have a huge scene, like in 3D with a lot of geometry data, it's the best format to use. You can enable the update in editor within the inspector and try to move the model with the gizmos to check if it's all working properly. Now let's get the animations, go to your browser and search for Mixamo. Then just simply choose a model, for the best result just select the X or a bot since it works well in retargeting animations. In our case, I have selected the abot.
Next, choose your animations. Make sure to check the in place option since we will not be using root motion. Adjust also the character arm space for better compatibility with your model. After all of that, save it in a single folder. Now open Blender to join the animations. Press N on the keyboard to hide slash unhide the panel. I'm using the Finepoint G plugin for joining animations. Download link is in the description. Any Blender version will work, but I'm using 4.2. Next click the folder option and locate the folder where all of your animations are stored including the typos. First enable the delete armatures option. This will remove all the unnecessary armatures and left only the abot with all of the animations. Now click Import Animations and the model will appear with all of the animations. This will contain all of the animations. Now save the blend file within the project directory since newer versions of Godot can read blend files. This allows us to add more animations without exporting it again and again. 
After that open Godot and it will load the model with animations. After it loads, same process again, select the Skeleton 3D and create a new bone map with new human profile humanoid and then re-import it. After that go to your scene or on any scene and instantiate the Mixamo model to get the animations. Choose the animation player for the Mixamo model, then manage animations and then save the library on your chosen folder or create a new folder for it. You can now delete the Mixamo model since we are done with it. Choose your VRM character. Go to the animation player, then manage animations, after that load the animations and we are done. Please subscribe OEAEA.